the improved common box functionality now allows you to customize all the elements of the common box. So if we take a look at the screen and turn on the common box, we can now control what part of the visual the common box represents. So you can just hover over the line between the common box and the rest of the visual and simply drag and drop to make it bigger or smaller depending on your needs. You can also control all of the elements within the common box. So if you explore, expand the settings, you will see now you have the options of turning off the titles completely. You can display just a title error and the value or display all the possible values. You can also switch between different relative or absolute or both variances within the settings. So you can just click on the drop down menu and switch between those different elements. Maybe let's extend the comment box a little bit and see how it functions. Uh, you can also control the different variance icons. So by default it will be a triangle but you can also switch to a circle or a circle with arrows. And both of these settings can be controlled on the visual itself. So you can just simply click on the labels to switch between the settings and the same can be done for the icons. Next you have complete control over the design. So you can place the comment box even on different areas of the visual. So you can switch between uh, right or left placement, above or below. And if you place it above, of course you want to list the comments accordingly. And you have this option of listing the comments horizontally and then you can control also the padding uh, between uh, the elements of the comments or gap between the comments themselves, so maybe we can increase it in this particular case. We can also add a background color or a drop shadow just by toggling it on or off to visually distinguish the comment box from the rest of the visual. You can also add a border and some radius to uh, give it a smooth edge. Next, if we take a look at the charts, in this particular case, maybe we want to make the comments bigger and, and the change the font sizes. So this is now possible in the new common box. If we go to the common box settings, at the end you will find the options for custom title and value fonts. So you can just toggle those on. And as you can see, this is probably a good font size in this particular case. And we can switch also to a different, let's say, a Calibri font in both the titles and the values.